For many Treasure Coast business owners, the COVID-19 pandemic brought much more than just masks and social distancing. Many businesses deemed non-essential were ordered to close for nearly two months, but rent, utilities, and workers' wages were still due. Now Martin County, through the National CARES Act, is offering grants to help those businesses pay those bills. Along Southwest Monterey Road near Canner Highway sits the nail spa of Stewart. We we'll do a uh, nail servant, a manicure, pedicure, uh, acrylic, uh, dipping powder, waxing. Kit Vo opened the full service nail salon four years ago and supports his family of six with income from the business. But I'm uh, trying to, my best to, to keep this place going. When the state ordered non-essential businesses to close due to the coronavirus pandemic in March, nail salons were hit particularly hard as they were not allowed to stay open. That two months is really tough for us because uh, I still have to pay rent, I still have to pay utility. Kit did everything he could to keep his employees, but it was a financial strain. Some of them, I keep them, but just part time. I, I can't afford to pay everybody full time. He didn't know if his business could last. Even though when we reopened uh, May 11, we still don't get the uh, amount of, of customer like before the COVID. But then he heard about Martin County's business renewal program. I say, you know what, I need this, so I'll give it a shot. <laughs> and that's what I did. Small businesses that lost income due to the pandemic can be awarded upwards of $20,000 and not have to worry about ever paying it back. Right now, based on what we're seeing, we're expect, I'm expecting, I'll say, uh, between 250 and 500 applications for these grants. Dan Hudson manages the business renewal program for Martin County, the temporary office set up in the Cummings Library in Palm City. In Martin County, $5.6 million has been set aside to go to local businesses that have been, um, that were forced to close or otherwise limit their operations during the, during the virus. He says there are many steps in the qualification process. It's a reimbursement grant, which means that there had to be tangible expenses that are documented. The first round of checks are set to go out in September, including $17,000 that will go to Kit and his nail spa. Very exciting. This is a lifesaver. Uh, it take a lot of stress off for me. The program will remain open until November 30th, or as long as funding is available. To do a self-assessment to see if your business is eligible for the grant and to apply for funds, go to our website at martin.fl.us slash business renewal. For Martin County Television, I'm Bob Hoganson.